Welcome to Beijing's World Robot Exhibition, where you can encounter robots that act a lot like humans. The robots displayed here are divided into three categories, industrial, service, and specialized. Let's start with the bot that's stealing the show, Android Genmanoid F. She may be as lifelike as it gets. The female humanoid was created by Hiroshi Ishiguro Laboratory at Osaka University. And it's easy to see why people want to interact with her. One of the creators, Kohei Ogawa, says looks can be deceiving, and the robot is still a work in progress. Of course, our you know, final goal is creating some AI system, artificial intelligence, by using this robot. But still it's difficult. For example, voice recognition system it doesn't work. You know, especially in this kind of noisy environment. So that's why practically this robot is useful for the teleoperated media. But in the future, of course, we're gonna create some perfect AI system by using this robot. To know the humans, to create the humans. Right. The bold. The other attention-grabbing humanoid is Xiao Luo, a robot made by Tammy Intelligence. He already has a following and is famous for interacting with people and hosting television galas. Product manager Lu Boyi. It has plenty of facial expressions and the screen installed in its eyes can give people a good feeling of interaction and it can follow the human body, which means it can imitate your gestures when you are in front of it. Most importantly, it can recognize if you're a man or a woman and tell your age and whether you are happy and the degree of your happiness. It knows all of that. For other designers, the focus is on producing robots that reduce the repetitive acts of human labor. Beijing has targeted robotics as a key sector for development hoping to create several domestic robotics champion firms to boost annual production. The three-day conference is the first to be hosted here, but certainly won't be the last.